Hello guys, I am Vithal Rachakonda, mathematician from Future Minds, Namdevada, Nizamabad. Today, we are going to discuss the topic triangles. First of all, what is triangle? Triangle is a closed figure which is having three lines. So, like A, B, C is a triangle where A, B, B, C, C, A. These are called sides where A, B, C are the vertices of a triangle. So, this triangle is having three angles, three sides where a, B is the A, B, B, C, C, A are the sides. Angle A, angle B, angle C are the angles. Now, these three, sum of these three angles is 180 degrees. Uh, if we add these three triangles, angles, then we get the total value is 180 degrees. Where the BC is represented by a small letter, BC length represented by small letter because which, which is opposite to angle A. Similarly, this AC is represented by small letter small b because it is opposite to angle B and uh, this AB is represented by small c because it is opposite to small c. So here yeah, angles are represented by capital letters and lengths of sides are represented by small letters. If you take one angle is angle A, angle A we can represent in three ways, angle A or angle BAC or angle CAB. Anyway, these three are equal to angle A. Similarly, angle B is represented by angle ABC or angle CBA. Both are representing angle B. The similarly, angle C. Angle C means angle ACB or angle ABC. Both are representing angle C. So, so every angle is having, we can write like this, angle A or angle BAC or angle CAB. Similarly, we can write angle B, angle C also. So, if we discuss about the triangles, we have six types of triangles with respective sides, three triangles, with respective angles, three triangles, where before that, what is acute angle, what is obtuse angle, what is right angle? Acute means angle should be between 0 to 90. That is called acute angle. Whenever angle is more than 90, less than 180, that is called obtuse angle. Whenever the angle equal to 90, that is called right angle. So, with respect to angles, we have three types of triangles. One is acute angle triangle, second obtuse angle triangle, third right angle triangle. So three types of triangles with respect angles. And also we have three types, three more types where we represent with sides. If three sides are equal, the triangle is called equilateral triangle because in that all angles are equal, all sides are equal. Each angle equal to 60 degrees. Then we have isosceles triangle. Isosceles triangle means in triangle only two sides are equal. That triangle is called isosceles triangle. And third one, no side equal that is called skeleton triangle. So with respect to sides we have three triangles with respect to angle three triangles total types of triangles are six. So this right angle triangle is having special side where this is right angle triangle where one angle is 90 degrees this is called right angle triangle. So in this one side is having special name, particular name, the side which is opposite to 90 degrees. In this triangle ABC, 90 is angle B, opposite side is AC, this is called, this is having particular name, the name of that side is hypotenuse. So in right angle triangle, one side is having particular name that is called hypotenuse. So, 
this right angle triangle we use in trigonometry where we have a, we are going to find trigonometrical ratios that is applicable only in right angle triangle our next topic is trigonometry we are going to discuss some problems some definitions in the trigonometric topic